there. Today I'm gonna show you a treatment. It's very, very special and unique. We have a two week old baby girl and she's still admitted to hospital because when she was born, she was in a transverse position and that ended up in a C-section. So uh, she also had some troubles eating. So her suction uh, motorics were a little bit delayed. So she had to have some occupational therapy, etc., in the hospital. Uh, so we're actually seeing her now uh, and I'm gonna see if she has any tongue tie, lip tie, anything like that, that might explain why she has poor suck but it might just be mechanical and that can be trained by doing daily exercises with the baby. She also suffered from colic, which is excessive gas, which creates pain from the intestine and that will uh, make the baby cry excessively for hours on end. So we're gonna have a look at her belly and the nerves that go from her spine to her intestine. Uh, I use a small tool called an activator to gently mobilize the spine. And I can make it very, very gentle all the way down to one week old. So I always customize the treatment for the baby in front of me and how old and how big or small the baby is. You ready for a little one? Yes. Good girl. And just open up her spine here. Good. Yeah, you're doing well. You're doing well. You're so precious. Yes, you are. <laughs> How wonderful it was to have little Nova with us and it turned out she didn't have tongue or lip tie everything looked normal uh, so it's just her motoric that was a bit delayed and that will be trained and they will continue doing exercises at home next up is a mom with her five month old daughter I've been seeing the mom throughout her pregnancy and the baby right after birth and today it's her five month checkup. We're gonna just check everything on her and see how she's doing. So let's go get them. Hey, hello. Hello. Come in. Hi. Hello. <laughs> yep. She's doing really well. Yeah. She's rolling. Yeah. She's kind of mobile, so she warms herself around. Yeah. And she's very chatty lately as well. Oh. Hello. 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 <laughs> so cute. You're so cute. Yes, you are. Let's see. You're rolling around a lot, huh? Just like our mommy. Yes. Yes. Good girl. They're beautiful, huh? Very good. Very good. You can grab it if you want. Yeah. Yeah, you can grab it. If you're allowed, you're allowed. Good. 
ってるって言って。She's looking to the side. Yeah, so this is still a little bit easier for her. See the difference? Okay. You have a little something in the neck today. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Okay. So now I'm just doing trigger point in the muscle. Yeah. It's a baby mess. Click here, and we have this activator. It's a very gentle way to treat the neck on babies. It makes a little sound, just like this. Can I see hands? You can feel it here, like that. Yeah. It makes a little sound, but it's very controlled, very safe. And we'll just give her two clicks here to open up the neck. There we go. There we go. And then I will just uh, bring her up. So here I'm just holding for any tension. It's normal when they start moving around to have a little bit of tension here in the lower back. And you have a little bit here. So I'm just holding this to release it. So there's no manipulation like we do on grown-ups. It's more of a mobilization very gently and massage. Yeah, you be tight darling. If I find the tension, I will give it a little bit with the activator on that point to release. Good girl. Good girl. I'm going to give you a little bit here. So you click. Good girl. Do you see how she's a little bit more tight there? Small reaction in the lowest bit. Good girl. You're doing so well. Okay, and then we can just do a little massage on her. Yeah, you want that? Yeah. Okay, so here, if you take just this off, yeah. keep the pants on, then I'll just show how you can do on the belly. So I'm just going to show you quickly how you can massage the baby. And this you can do at home as well. So just make sure, because it's a baby, we don't press too hard. I always say press like you would press on a ripe tomato without mm -hmm. breaking it. That's the amount of pressure we can use. Her rib cage is here, you can kind of feel it. So we don't press on the rib cage. We go here, follow the intestine, and around clockwise. Yes, to help the digestion. Oh. Hello. Is it nice? I like yeah. you here. Is it nice? You can use baby oil as well if you want. But this is a really nice way <laughs> to connect with a baby. Hi baby. Hello. And you can do little circles, but again still clockwise. Just little circles like this. Yeah. Good. And then of course you can cycle and just go like this to alleviate any gas that might be. Yes. You're doing well, right? Usually around five months, it will not be so gassy as in the beginning. Yeah, yeah. So around four weeks to five months is normal to have a little bit of gas. But she seems fine. But this is a good exercise to do if there's a bit of gas in the belly. And then massage around. Massage around. And you can also go and just start with the left foot and go from the heel up towards here. Nice. Oh. Just turn you around. You can see what we're doing here. Direction. All the way around. Clockwise. All the way around. Yes. You're liking it, aren't you? 
And then the feet here. Start with the left and go up towards the big toe here. This activates her intestines as well. Here we go. Good girl, is that nice? Yeah. Good girl. Yeah. Good girl. And then the other foot. And this is a good thing. You can do that every day at home if you want. It's a great way to connect. Even before or after a bath. Mm -hmm. yeah. Good girl. You did so well. Yay. High five. High five. Good girl. Good. And that's how you massage a baby. Yes. Yes. Did you like it? Was it good? Yes. If you like this video, remember to like and subscribe. And please leave comments below if you have any questions at all. Bye-bye. See you next time. Bye-bye.